acted all big and was a perverted idiot, but he was a pretty good person. I remember the time he fixed the air conditioner, and even the chairs and tables, too. Um, I was the one who did that. Anyway, he was a good person. Oh, Lord! Why do the good ones always die first? I should have been the one to die. Might as well. That's how it feels. Like you're trying to hide that you actually think I should have died. Cause no one likes me. But I agree with you. It would be much better for the hated one to die instead of the leader of the Warriors of Hope. Ah, that reminds me. That's totally true. Masaru was the leader, huh? What are we to do without our leader? <laughs> oh, Masaru! Oh no, Monica is crying. If that's the case, then allow me to join you! Masaru wouldn't have died. I'm a useless loser. And being locked in a bathroom by Masaru is no excuse. It's my fault for being there. I shouldn't have been pooping in the first place. Hey now, it's not as if we're positive that Masaru is dead, right? He was so strong, so full of life. Now he's just a chunk of meat. Like I said, according to the Monokuma kids report, they did not say he was dead. The report indicated that he was captured by adults, and his status is unknown. But unknown? That means he's dead, right? Huh? Back to those talk shows I used to be on when times were peaceful. Hearing status unknown or unconscious, you knew they're probably gonna die anyway. That's what I always thought anyway. But, but even so, if we don't actually confirm it for ourselves... No, it would be pointless. Our precious Masaru, he's returned to the Earth now. But we should have someone go look into it, just in case. It's gonna be useless! Masaru is dead! A prince who became a star! What is essential is invisible to the eye! My goodness, you made Monica mad! Oh, now you're gonna be the hated one, Nagisa. Even more than me. Huh? But it stopped short! Never to go again! When the old man died, you know! R right I understand. It's just as you say. Masaru died. That's just what I need to believe. Well then, now that we all feel the same way, let's say our prayers to Masaru. Rest in peace, our hero Masaru. You were a grand leader. You worked your hardest, like a real hero should, though you were a coward. Whew, I feel much better now after a good cry. Okay now, let's get back to the game! Alright, the fun's not over yet! You... want to continue with this? Is it not more important to work on establishing Paradise further? There are other adults around. Nakisa, you don't want to play anymore? Do you hate Monica now because Monica's just so selfish? N no of course not We're allies, and we'll create Paradise together after all. Do you like Monica? Where did that come from? 
I hardly think it's appropriate to discuss that now. So you don't like me? L like I said, it's not that. You know, Nagisa, that attitude of yours? You're acting just a little bit like an adult. Adult? You're an adult? D don't be stupid. That's not true. I'll be a kid until I die. I would rather die right now than become an adult. Don't you believe me? Then, do you like me? I... I like you. Yay! Nagisa likes Monica! I like you as an ally, with whom I can build paradise. It's not love or anything. Oh, this is bad. Nagisa is burning up. Jotaro, you're our priest. Chant some healing magic. Oh, heaven, change my words to life. Give mercy to the lost soul. hi -ya! Stop that! Don't tease me! Jeez, don't be so mean to Nagisa. Nagisa, Kotoko, we are all allies here. We need to learn to get along. I'm standing right here. You didn't mention me because you hate me, right? That must be it. So let's all get along, okay? Let's have fun hunting together, okay? Yeah! As expected of our Monica, positive as always. I just love that about you. Uh, of course, it's not just that. I love everything about you. Fine. Let's continue the game. I have no further objections. That's our vice leader. Wait, you're the leader now. The leader? Yeah, I mean, that hero guy. Um, what was his name? Well, anyway, our last leader died. So since you were vice leader, you're promoting. I'm the leader of the Warriors of Hope? Yeah, that's right. I have high expectations of you, our new leader, Nagisa. Y yeah, high expectations for me. Good. You're so reliable. I knew I could count on you. Oh, you're headed out, Monica? Where are you going? Hmm, I have a little business to take care of. Bye-bye! Business? What kind of business? Monica always goes off on her own like that. Prying into a lady's private life? If you were an adult, that'd be sexual harassment. Oh, could it be her tummy? Do you think maybe she just has to poke? Ugh, you actually went there? That topic is off limits! Jeez, I hope you die in the worst way. But I heard that going to the bathroom once in a while is actually really healthy. Excuse you, but our little Monica does not do number two! You'll just have to settle with mine. W wait, that makes it sound like I'm a pervert or something. Oh no! This is such a bother! What if my good image is soiled by this? What if people avoid me all the time and I can split them like Moses? Oh, that actually sounds pretty good. Anyway, there's no need whatsoever to worry about where Monica goes. She's not telling us because it's something we don't need to know. Yeah. I should remember to just focus on hunting demons, and also to always brush my teeth. Aha! Cheater! I won't let you get a head start. I'm gonna go hunt down demons as well! You're right. We should focus. This is Monica, after all. This game surely has some purpose. 
Perhaps it's to send a message to the coward adults that they cannot win against us. Yes, that's probably it. This game can play a vital role in establishing our paradise. You were totally against it a minute ago. Did the power of being a leader go to your head? W what was that? Uh, guys, Monica said no fighting. Hey, you guys. Thanks for waiting. Here you go. Some nice, freshly made milkshakes. You're too late. Monica already left. My sincerest apologies. I didn't know how to make them. And of course, I couldn't look it up. Uh, is this how milkshakes are supposed to look? It's all murky. I'm not certain. I did make sure to add the sugar and the rendered fat. Rendered fat? Did you really intend to make your rulers the warriors of hope drink this swill? I think you'll be the one drinking the slimy thing instead. That's an order. Ah, oh, but how troubling. If I keep drinking it down, I'll feel it filling up my stomach. But if it's your order, Master, I live to serve. I am your servant, after all. <laughs> For some reason, a completely empty station like this makes me anxious. It's dark and creepy. Weirds me out. And it's not just that. Like I thought, the trains aren't moving. But if we walk along the railway from here, we should be able to get out of the town, right? Right? There's no mistaking it, right? I mean, we're gonna be saved, right? Ugh, so noisy. We won't know until we find out, will we? Let's hurry up and go. Let's just run from here! Oh, but actually, maybe it would be better if we pretended like we were dead to avoid attacks. Hey, Toko, do you know how to do a good zombie impression? I'm not doing that. Ugh, this place is so dark! I miss the surface where it was bright. Well, it was really only slightly brighter. What's the point of going through the ticket gate? Total waste of money. Huh? Did we pay? but we already knew that. I know, but to see it in person stop like this makes me kind of down, is all. Jeez, are you really going to get depressed over every little thing? Yeah, you're right. We should just walk along the railway. Then we'll be safe, right? Like I said earlier, we can't know that for sure. Believing a lie so strongly just makes the truth that much more painful. Pop idols aren't virgins. Lottery numbers are fixed. This world is much easier to deal with if you look at it rationally. I think you might have gone a bit off topic there. For now, there's no other option than to try, right? You're right. Something wrong, Toko? Are you worried about something? No, 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 not really. It's nothing. It's just... Didn't I tell you? I'm afraid of the dark. 
Is that all? There's something else bugging you, isn't there? Listen, if you have a bad feeling about this, or you can sense some kind of danger... What, do you think I'm some kind of psychic danger detector or something? If we're gonna do this, let's hurry up and do it now. We'll have time to think later. The both of us. Hm? Uh, okay. I didn't know it'd be this dark. I knew it. I shouldn't have come here. We can get out of town from here, right? For some reason, it's getting darker and darker. Shouldn't we start heading back now? Oh, don't say that. Let's just keep going a bit farther. Shield! 
The gun and grenades don't work! Then we need to get out of here fast! <laughs> we, we gotta run! They're not chasing us anymore. No, it isn't! It's not even one micron funny! Ow! What? What was that? Something hit my head. It felt like something fell on me from above. From above? This is your fault for yelling so loud! What do we do? What do we do? Good luck, the cute one is here! Huh? We gotta run, Dekomaru! Hurry, let's dash! To our... Horizon! Hey! Wait a sec! The tunnel's about to collapse! Dash, dash, dash! Kids aren't gonna let us through. You... 
also changed by sneezing? That's right. If I have a little pepper in my breakfast or lunch. <laughs> She really did change. I... I don't know what happened, but... I can take a guess. Jeez, this is one tough break after another. How unlucky are you? This is... wrong. Definitely wrong. I just want to get out of this place. Why... Why can't I do it? Was I right? Is it really impossible? I'll never escape. That might be the case. Huh? But even if you can't escape, you can still survive. All you need to do is face them. Fight them. Fight? Toko, what are you saying? There's no way I can fight. Don't be so sure. Wait, hold on. Over there. Huh? What is it? A monitor? Is it some kind of trap again? Huh? Well, what's with this creepy little kid? Uh, am I on already? Oh! I was gonna raise the curtain after Kotoko introduced me with a joke! Hey, is this kid with them too? Is he a part of that Warriors of Hope or whatever? Y yeah Yeah. I'm the priest, Jachiro Kimuri, a.k.a. Lil Ultimate Art. But I'll warn you now... Don't say my name out loud. It's a curse. D -d Don't mess with me, brat. Take off that mask. I'm sweating just looking at it. N no, horrible. If I do that, your eyeballs are gonna explode. Huh? Even I don't want to see that. Someone's eyeballs melting off because of my face. Oh, by the way, do you know? Is it just an urban legend that they use bugs to make food dye? Because, like, wasabi and stuff, with the taste and the color, it's suspicious. You, I'm sure you've heard this before, but you are totally gross. Duh? Gross? I don't know, I think I'm a cheerful kid. Oh, maybe I... I just don't understand what cheerful is. Then I apologize. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. From the bottom of my heart, I'm so sorry. I beg you, forgive me. I'm sorry. E enough already. You're grossing me out. Huh? You don't forgive me? If you don't forgive me, does that mean... Hate me? Well, maybe not. Maybe you're just teasing me, like boys who tease the girls they like. <laughs> I mean, if you guys are little boy lovers and just want to love me till you go crazy. Even if we were siblings in a previous life, I'd still hate you. What are you trying to say? I, I don't really get it. Well, I can understand that. This is like a yawn, after all. It just comes out of my mouth involuntarily. Nobody can make anything of it. I don't even understand it either. This whole thing is just killing time. Just a distraction from the horrors around you. You guys must be pretty laid back if you're actually interested in what I'm saying. As expected of demons. I've had enough of this. Goodbye. Oh, wait, hold on! I was just trying to be nice. 
I wanted to tell you something. Tell us what? Um, it's regrettable, but the one with the wristband can't leave the city. C can't leave? Why? Well, you're a target for our game, right? The game isn't fair if there aren't any rules. Everything was already thought out. So that means there's a limit in this game. A limit? Don't tell me. The reason that boy exploded when he tried to leave the town swimming. Huh? Th that's not our fault. It's not like we wanted him to blow up or anything. The wristband is made to explode when the user goes outside the town without permission. Well, when I say it like that, I guess it kinda is our fault. What? You should have said that in the first place. Omaro here was about to explode. But some things are better left unknown. I don't say that all the time. It would be better for Mr. Pig if he didn't find out he was about to be bacon. It doesn't change the fact that Mr. Pig is gonna die. So isn't it better not to tell him? Oh, d d don't go acting all philosophical about this. This game's rules are managed way too loosely. You're wrong! This isn't a game! I mean, people are dying! Yuda, he... He died, you know? To call what happened to him a... a game? There are some games that require you to risk your life. Huh? What do you mean? Hello? Can you not just ignore me? I don't like being ignored. Hey, um, which do you not like more? Being ignored or ghosts? I don't like ghosts more. Ghosts are always cursing people and killing them all of a sudden. It makes me super mad. Stop it already! Stop saying things that make no sense! That's right. Just keep hating me. All you have to do is hate me. I'm from the hate planet, where being hated makes you feel good. And it's easier to just be hated. Oh, don't worry. I hate gross little boys like you to death. Huh. What you just said? Doesn't it kind of sound like love? If you flip it around? I was worried. So I had to make double sure. That's why I called you guys. Double sure? If you guys see this, you're gonna hate me even more! Ta-da! the shopping district. And this one, I hunted in the bathroom. <laughs> oh, are you disgusted? But I can't just stop. Making dioramas is like the only hobby I have. So how about it? I put a bad taste in your mouth, so now you hate me, right? Or maybe... You guys aren't affected by this. 
because you have disgusting hobbies, too. Please, just stop already! Why do you want me to stop? Because you already hate me enough? Or because you don't wanna hate me? Because it's a waste of time? Because you're tired of it? Because you don't want to be? I mean, I don't know for sure. I'm just a kid. So I don't know what you really mean. <laughs> you... How crazy can you be? And if I am, whose fault is it? Well, it doesn't really matter. After all, I have so much fun now compared to before. I should thank Mr. and Mrs. Demons. I want to say thank you for teaching me that I'm nothing but ugly, nasty, worthless filth. I live like filth, surrounded by filth, inside this paradise where no adults can get in the way. <laughs> Crying like a kid won't make them treat you like one. Are you really going to just accept it? Be their prey? If not, there's only one thing to do. You can't run, you have to fight. Like I said, that's impossible! No, it's not impossible. You have Master's gun, don't you? No, that's not what I mean. I'm not like you. I'm just a normal high school student who can't do anything, you know? Just running would be hard enough, but to fight? That's impossible. And just why do you think I'm here? What? I'm not telling you to deal with it on your own. You better not forget. I'm with you too. T Toko. I if it's impossible to do on your own, well then I guess I have to do it with you. So just a little more. Just fight a little bit more. It's okay to rely on you? Y you've already relied on me. Isn't it a bit late to ask that? You're right. Sorry. If you have time to apologize, might as well do it outside. The atmosphere here is... oppressive. Hey, Toko... I already told you, don't apologize. No, it's not that. Thank you. W what are you being so honest for? It's just... Ugh, gross. So, come on, enough with that grossness, and let's hurry up and get outside. Yeah. Let's hurry and get outside. Yeah. Too many of them. It's too dangerous to go that way. Then what should we do? Don't ask me. I'm not your personal GPS. S sorry, you're just so reliable I thought I'd ask. Reliable? 
Well, well, it is true that my brain is far superior to yours. Now, let's see. It might be better to head back underground for now, to find another exit. Back through the underground? Are you sure you're okay with that? What do you mean? I mean, you're afraid of the dark, aren't you? The underground is pretty dark. Shit! Oh! Are you trying to be an example? To show me how to go forward, even if you're scared? I see. As expected of a true mentor. Ah! Uh... Is that a new kind of bullet? This looks pretty useful. But this gun belongs to Future Foundation, right? So why are the kids giving me bullets? I, I, I guess maybe there might be some kids in the group who want to support us. Huh? Support us? But who cares about that right now? Let's just look for the exit. Uh, yeah. guy again counter it with the new ammo is just out of the question. Isn't it just going to get darker if we keep going? Is it really going to be okay? It's probably going to be fine. Oh, you suck at cheering people up. Can't you choose your words more wisely? Well, I'm sure you're just laughing at me in your head, thinking I'm just some scared little girl. I'm not laughing about it. I don't like dark places either. But honestly, for some reason, I feel... At ease. Why do you feel at ease? You enjoy taking pleasure in other people's suffering? My suffering tastes delicious and you're planning on a four-course meal, huh? You sure have a bitchy personality. You're the type to talk trash at a wedding, aren't you? I, I didn't mean it like that. I just mean that I'm sure you're working hard, too. Of course. Even I'm at my limit. I'm scared of blood and the dark and I'm just... So tired, but th there's no choice but to do it. I'm not some crybaby, whiny, airheaded girl. Whiny, crybaby. What? Yeah! Yeah! What? What was that? S sorry, I tried to scare you, but then your reaction scared me. Huh? You 
really are an idiot. I was just trying to ease the tension a little. Yeah, well, now I'm more afraid of your stupidity than the dark. Oh, sorry. Making a shopping district underground like this? What was the administration thinking? Maybe it's subtle political satire? Monokuma's coming from! stairs y you're right but let's head over there Right.
This door is locked. It's a Monokuma! Don't come near me! locked It's that arcade machine again in one go. Someone's getting ambushed. We gotta go save them! mean? Monokuma's beating up another Monokuma? That's surprising. I never figured robots would have internal discord. <sighs> I thought I was gonna die. <laughs> it, it talked. Oh, don't be scared. It's okay. I'm not a particularly suspicious bear. I'm a nice bear. The kind of bear who would give my opponent the corner in Othello. Oh, Maru, what are you doing? Hurry up and shoot this thing! Y yeah Why? Please don't shoot me! I promise you'll understand if we just talk it out. Talk? Why are you even talking in the first place? I have an AI inside me. I'm different than the other Monokumas. AI? Artificial intelligence? It's inside you? That's right. I can think and reason. I won't run amok like those other bears. 
I'm your ally. Look, I'm all white, see? <laughs> I'm a white bear, so I'd like to be called Shirokuma. You know, it's kind of cute. <laughs> Don't be fooled. It's more unnatural if it's all white. It's like a curry plate without the curry. Don't say that. We can be friends. I want to be friends with as many pretty ladies as possible. P pretty? Hmm. He may look suspicious, but I can see he has a pretty good eye. Toko gets easily fooled too, huh? That's right. I have a good eye for judging character. For example, just by looking at your face, I can guess the time and date of your first kiss. Huh? Oh, what a horrifying function. It's horrifying? I mean, if you can tell that about the first kiss, then you should know other firsts, right? If he uses that power, he can mercilessly expose frauds who claim to be virgins. Huh? Girl power is mostly from virginity. This is why so many girls try so hard to be seen as virgins. But if we have this one's power, we can uncover the misdeeds of those fraudulent career women. There's no mistaking it. This power can change the world. Uh, I was just giving an example. And what does this have to do with our current situation anyway? I guess you're right. I got a little heated there. By the way, what are you guys doing in a place like this? Fragile girls wandering around a dangerous place like this is a big no-no. What? Are you going to lecture us now? It's not our fault. We don't know where to go. I see. So you're drifters. Girls driven into a corner with nowhere to run. If that's the case, leave it to me. I can take you to a safe place. Huh? A safe place? Well, that's quite suspicious. It's something a kidnapper would say. You went through a lot up till now, so you have trouble trusting people. I understand. But the world is also full of amazing people. You don't have to be so pessimistic. Sorry, but words coming out of a Monokuma's mouth aren't exactly persuasive. Hey, where is the safe place you're talking about? Full disclosure, there's a secret base here underground where adults are living and hiding. S secret base? Did you hear that, Toko? A secret base with adults gathered there. We should go there too, right? Hey, what do you think? I mean, what should we do? E even though it was hard enough to find an exit, you want to keep going through the underground? Uh, but it's dangerous to use those stairs. There are tons of Monokumas lurking around the exit. Huh? See? So wouldn't it be a smarter idea to find the secret base? That doesn't mean this guy's telling the truth. He is a Monokuma, after all. I just want to save you. If you come with me, you can see whether or not I'm telling the truth. You hear that? What do we do? If you think we shouldn't, then I'll go with you. But logically, this is the best option, right? This is the kind of chance that, like, 100 out of 100 people would take. Just be honest and say you want to go. Jeez, you're annoying. Fine. You want me to go? Then I'll go. Right. Then let's do that! Alright, I'll lead, so follow me! Yeah! I'll leave it to you, Shirakuma! Uh, over there! We gotta go over there! Which way is over there? Jeez, you're a terrible navigator. It's 
no good. It's locked. No problem. Leave it to me. Leave it to you? What are you gonna do? What? It went inside. And it came out. Ta-da! It's unlocked now. Amazing! That's a pretty convenient body. A convenient body? That's a pretty strange way to put it. Yeah! 